Hi. Malta 1116 coming at you. Sorry, your position is looking up at me. I broke my little phone holder. That was, a, I think someone else broke it. But, so I had to move and now you're at a different level down there. But hey, how's everybody doing? Um, I don't know, it seemed like every time I wanna make a video and I said I'm gonna get back on track something traumatic happens in my life um, I recently had to bury my mother so uh, I knew my mother's been sick for a while um, she was on dialysis for years uh, wow about 10 years the doctors were amazed uh, with how long and how well she was doing um, but uh, she took ill didn't know didn't really understand how serious her condition was she didn't let us know um, the depths of uh, her illness she used to live here in New Jersey then she went to North Carolina to take care of her father her father still lives an oh, amazing man uh, 93 her father's 93 and um, she had been sick for a while so I usually go down there periodically and, you know, go down there and rough her up a little bit. Look, start taking care of yourself and, you know, do what's right, do what you're supposed to be doing. So that's actually what I was going to do. However, when I got to North Carolina, it was a different story. I knew when I seen her in the hospital, this is not good. So, um, actually, I ended up staying down there because uh, I'm like okay this this is much more serious than I thought and even then she still was hey I'm fine I'm doing good still had that same attitude oh you know what I don't know if you can hear me with this radio on let me turn it down um but long story short I'll get into details about things later because it actually was a wake up call for myself and I'm the only girl. Um, she had four children, three boys, one girl. I had lost a brother last year in uh, August. No, it was going on two years now. In August, um, health problems. Um, but I was the only girl. So, it, long story short, like I said before, uh, I, I'm dealing with that. Um, dealing with it hard. I actually, I'm actually thinking about seeking some counseling. I went to pick up my phone uh, yesterday to call her. I'm like, April, what you doing? You can't call her. <laughs> you know, so I'm, I'm smiling about it now, but yesterday was not a good day. So I have to get back on track, back on track, because I know I was doing good, going to the gym, not eating sweets. That all went downhill. Um, I've been emotional eating. I've been eating for no, you know what? I can't even call it emotional eating because it's been all the time. I always stuff in my mouth back to those old habits. Now that I'm back in New Jersey, I don't went back to work and everything. So um, I'm trying to get back on track so I can get this weight that I get. I didn't gain it all back, but I definitely want to, you know, I never hit Wonderland. I got real close. Um, so I need to get things together so I can get back to Wonderland. But anyway, um, again, Mark 1116 coming at you. Not too much to talk about in this update other than I am, you know, I have been going to the gym now. It's only been like twice I've been, I actually, and I, then I walked around the local park that I have here. I'm going to dust my bike off. The weather's been so funny cold rain warm it's not been consistency with good weather where i could just do my usual routine so i've been making the best of it so um yeah i'm going to get back into it it's kind of hard you know but i can do it i can do it gotta do it Alrighty. so again mark level 16 coming at you <sighs> Let's hope no more tragedies. I pray. God help me. <laughs> God be with me. Um, 
talk to you soon. Okay, bye.